well, I guess ranting is in my nature. Um, oh, you know, I just want people to have power so bad. So, we're going to go over what Paul says here. And uh, So, at Romans 2.11, we got to go back to Romans 2.11. This is... Uh, so this is still getting to the truth, Romans Corinthians, Romans two eleven. Oh, I should have had a bookmarked. I should have had a bookmark. It's out right back there. Two eleven, Romans two eleven. For there is no respect of persons with God. There's a few way weird places, uh, Acts ten twenty four, but you know right here, right here, in Romans. God is no respecter of persons. So if you got something and I got I can't get it, somebody's got to be a liar. Because if I want it, why can't I have it? Because somebody said they're gifts. Anyway, so uh, Romans two eleven, God is no respecter of persons. You have to hold to that standard. There's got to be guidelines. There's got to be signposts that you can go by so that you can get to the proper answer every time. And knowing that God is no respecter of persons is a big deal because that's the flank. Bam! God's no respecter of persons. You you know, you think, but people have long suits, and those long suits are because of their their life, their history, what they do, what they've done is not going to be the same as what I've done and what I've seen and where I've been. So God works with long suits and puts gifts in there that only that individual can get. Okay? I'm not saying God doesn't give gifts. But I can't use your gift because your gift is your gift. But if the manifestation isn't a gift, it's a manifestation and I got the same stuff as you got. Right there, you're done. We all got the same thing. So I utilize everything I can use and you utilize everything you can use and we come together with that power pack, baby. And the threefold cord ain't quickly broken. God in the middle of my wife and I, man, woo. Uh, 1 John 1. Anyway, uh, Jesus Christ operated six manifestations. And then we can operate nine because of tongues, tongues and interpretation and prophecy. Uh Tongues, tongues, interpretation, and prophecy are uh, worship manifestations. It's perfect prayer. It gives thanks well, and then you can give uh, words to the congregation, interpretation, and prophecy. All that's learnable through the Way International. Beautifully done, too. Uh, we operate 9, Romans 8.26. Romans 8.26 is... Not 628. Yeah, I uh, get Dick's lexic and can't find anything. Uh, Lex Dixic? Dick's lexic. Lex Dixic? 826. Uh, Likewise, the Spirit also helpeth our infirmities, for we know not what we should pray for as we ought, but the Spirit itself maketh intercession for us with groanings which cannot be uttered. That's speaking in tongues. That's the perfect prayer. And that alone, if God only gave that to some people, would really be, well, you know. It says, uh, oh, it, there's another one that says, I'm at four minutes already. Uh, it brings health to your soul life. To your existence, your body, it's health to your soul. It quickens the mortal body, it says. It quickens the mortal body. You look up, quickens the mortal body. And some people are going to get that and others aren't. Any of it that you get that I don't, there's going to be a lack somewhere. There's going to be a lack somewhere if I get something and you don't. Oh, but uh, fucking heads of the church are going to tell you specifically, you you know, that, oh, the 140, what's, what's the difference between that and 144,000 going? Oh, if you're not one of the 144,000, uh, you can't take the bread and wine. 
in the uh, Jehovah's Witnesses organization. If you're not one of the 144,000, holy cow, how small is that God that you got there for 144,000 when there's how many billion people on the planet and he's only going to have 144,000? If you can't see that stupidity, just go ahead and stay there or join or whatever. Uh, so yeah, 826, how about 828? And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. And all things work together. So why would you, if, if I can think that God should have given us all the manifestations, each one of us, I can think bigger than God. If I can think that we should all have all nine manifestations and then nobody's lacking anything, sounds like a better deal than you getting a couple of gifts and me getting a couple of gifts. The hell with that shit. I want the whole package. Why don't you give me the whole package and I decide what I'm going to use from it? But I have the opportunity to use the whole package in love. Yeah. Is that possible? Jesus Christ operated all six. Word of, word of, word of knowledge, word of wisdom uh, with the woman at the well. You know, how many times did they pull up fish? Word of, word of knowledge, word of wisdom. Uh, you know, what did God tell him? Anyway, miracles, healings, and other the works. I don't think Jesus did any of those, do you? Okay, those are the six. Miracles, healings, and other works. Without miracles, Jesus isn't Jesus. Okay. Uh, now we got tongues, tongues of interpretation. And these that follow me shall cast out devils and heal the sick and speak in new tongues. 